the mesh matte cap material. Okay, so this is a high performance material. It's not affected by lighting. It uses a different concept of using an image of a sphere as the view space environment map. So the image contains pre-baked colors and shading. If you go to your favorite search engine and type in matte cap textures, this is what you see, a whole bunch of spheres just lighted in different ways. And this is pre-baking, just the color and the shine and the environment. And it's, it's that image that's mapped onto the object. So right now, I don't have any image assigned to the object. We still get color. So I grab the code. And up here, I have created some matte caps for us. If we look in image here. There is matte cap crystal, gold, a green, yellow, pink, an opal, and a red light. They're just spheres with a spherical projection, so you get the so darker on the outside there and lighter on the inside with a shine. Same with the crystal. Crystal's a very good one. These images are in the resources that you can add to your client image folder. Okay, so I have one enabled here, the matte cap opal PNG. And there's material dot matte cap, matte cap texture. Refresh. Okay, we can see pretty much what's going on there. It's very fast for rendering. It's like the mesh basic material or the mesh normal material. It's very high performance. It's not doing much more than just mapping that image onto the normals. So think of it as the mesh normal material, but instead of having the color gradient between purple and blue and orange, we have an image instead. And the color information is coming from the, the image. So this is being mapped to the normals. Okay, let's look at some different ones I've added. Crystal. Okay, the crystal looks really good. You know, the texture doesn't change. In the case of the sphere, it doesn't look like the sphere is rotating. It's like the mesh normal material. It's always the same. Doesn't matter what way you look at it. Lighting is not affected. All the shading and the shine comes completely from the texture image. Let's look at a few more. Gold. There's gold. Red light. It's red with a, a light. There's another one. And to show you the lighting has no effect, if I turn on this light, no effect. Even if I turn off the, the matte cap. And we can add a main text to the background. And refresh. And that's how that looks. So we can see the crystal effect over top of our main texture there and we don't get the environment map with mesh matte cap material that's the mesh matte cap material very high performance and very effective very quickly without needing to set lights or even other specular highlights